What up, what up? We're here with the Baseball Bat Bros, and today, folks, we're gonna try to figure out how much you should really be spending on a wood bat. We got a good mix of some uh, high-end, like, regular Victus and Marucci wood bats. We got a bomb bat. We got a DeMarini wood composite. We have bamboo. I'm here with Drew Burris and Petey Kraska, Georgia Tech commits. Let's get it. All right, so we've done a video like this before. We did a whole bunch of Louisville Sluggers. The problem is those are all prone to breaking. We're gonna take a bit more practical approach today, go with some durable options. We have three different price points here. So starting at $50, you guys haven't heard of this one, I don't think. We have the Empowered Bamboo Bat. There's a bunch of different brands that do bamboo and they're all pretty much the same. This is one of the few ones I've found that is more of like an i13 243 turn model. Actually has a big barrel on it. Moving up to $150, JT, really, really wanted this bat to be in the video. This was his gamer last year and he went off with it. We have the DeMarini Wood Composite D243 and then the highest price point here, I think up to like $300. If you customize one of these, maybe like $350. We have a Bombat Gold Maple. This is the end load version. If you get a Bombat, I really recommend the end load version. And we're gonna compare all three of these to, we have a Dovetail, we have a Chandler, we have a Victus and we have a Marucci. Lots of things to consider, so let's get it. All right, we waited till the sun went down. It's gonna look a lot better. We are starting out with a professional, traditional wood bat here. We're all gonna swing kind of our own gamer. I love this bat. We have the Victus MH17 Birch. This is the Mitch Hanniger model. It's cupped a lot, kind of like a T141, almost a Tatis kind of looking barrel. This thing absolutely flies through the zone. We're gonna see if those durable bats can hang with the big boys. Uh-oh, uh -oh. get in there, get in there, burn him. All right, come on. Go! Oh, that's pretty <laughs> dang good. Big climb. Good, good traditional home run. Six. Oh, oh yeah, that's, Gee, that's a good swing. You barreled that all right? Yeah, I got that. Oh, that boy. Little 400. Oh, good. Hey, oh, boy. That was nice. Yeah, that boy. That was nice. Oh. Got it, five, seven. That sounded like it hurt. Yep, that was a good damn shot. But it flies. It's right there. Yeah, boy. Yeah. Yeah. Birdie. Yeah. Man, miss hits are so good. Dude, that is absolute barrel. Absolute barrel. Yep. That's a good barrel. That's good piece. That's crisp. 100.2. Yep, right about there. It's going to hurt. Oh! Bruce Bones did it. 98.9. Oh my god. Oh. That'll work. Gorgeous. Oh boy. Bamboo uh, time? Ladies and gents, we got bamboo, not even a wood, it's grass, glued together, put on a lathe and turned. And for that reason, apparently it's very, very durable, very cheap and I think potentially underrated. I was sitting at about kind of low 100s there on good barrels, so we'll see. That is so heavy. We have a 271 as well. We might have to switch to that. Oh! Very, very surprised by that. 98.6. Dog. What is going on? 98.9. 98? That felt amazing. Dude, oh I'm kind of tripping out. 97.8. Yeah, that was a little bit towards the hands. Oh, okay. Dude, okay. that's, that's going to be humming. 99.8. Dude. <laughs> that's out of there, huh? That'll work. Is that going to carry? Get up. Oh, wow. Oh, my. That was, that was like the best one yet. 96.6. Oh, dude. This feels, this feels sweet. Ooh. 
Like it, it swings kind of good too. No, like, it actually feels. I mean, I, I like how it feels. Yeah. Well, that yeah. was so loud. Yeah, that, that came off good. Coming out quick. 94 Velo. Six. 94 six. Oh, I mean, it feels good. I don't think I'm hitting it quite as hard, but it yeah. does feel good. We're gonna try the 271, a much less impressive barrel profile, obviously. Like, you know, looking at those two together, it's very, very different. A uh, pretty, you know, wimpy looking bat. I think, prediction, this is gonna just light my hand up so bad. Yeah, that, that was terrible. Ow! Oh, there's a barrel. It's yeah, like, it's just not, sound that was smack, what was it? It's just not a realistic bat to hit with. When you have this entire part of the barrel just lights you up. If it is a heavy, dense piece of bamboo, it's fire. Just like, it's heavy, so that's the problem. That's pretty good, bro. I leaked out a little bit. Did that go over the scoreboard? No. Did it over under? 400 feet, huh? What was Velo? 100 foot one. 100 for 400 feet. That'll work. What the heck? That's a good bat. 9.61. That feels so nice, dude. It actually is good. Yeah, I like this. 99.5. Wow. Oh, boy. Is that oh no way. Nah, short off it. And between each round, I'm gonna try to revisit one swing with the regular wood bat so we can constantly kind of see that standard. Oh, that's so much easier to swing, dude. 148. That was smacked. Dude, that's absolutely Dog. Alright. Round one goes to the Victus purely for performance, but that's low-key good for $70. I was really surprised. This one, that, dude, that might be under right there. Yeah. I think that might be the hottest bat. All right, this is the pitch right here. All right. I'm, I'm, call, I'm calling, calling my shot right here. So. Oh, that was uh, a good swing though, good swing. People respect that. What? Wow. You have to pick. $200, 70 bucks, 50 bucks, whatever this is. Dude, I like, I, I can't, I, <laughs> Dude, I, don't, I, I honestly, I'm not honestly like, in the middle. Bamboozle. <laughs> Just performance. Pretend they're the same price. The Bang same. for your buck though, you got this? Yeah. All right. All right. The next bat in our rotation coming in at about $150. There are new versions that are $250, but right now, I know you can get these for $150. JT's former Juco Gamer, the DeMarini D243 Maple. Complete wood composite, guys. A rubber handle, pretty much. Very flexy, very forgiving. If it's BB Core stamped, it's probably not a pure wood bat, right? Oh, babe. Oh, I kinda like that. I kinda like that. That ball, that was really good barrel. No read. We are getting no life on the Rap Soto, boys. Sucks for us, but not really for you guys, because we'll be back in one second. A few moments later. We're back. It's been a fun to start the day. Gosh. Is that barely fair? Barely Come on. No way. Dude, if there's a, if there's a base there, there, there that's hitting the base. base. Yeah. Not even fair. Dude, that's great fair. bunting bat. This way. That's going to be 96. Okay. This ain't a 243. I know it says the number is 243 on the bat. That is a slim barrel. It's kind of balanced. It's not heavy swinging. Oh, yeah. 90. That should be 97. 93.6. Okay, it's soft. Least pop out of every bat so far, I think. But let's really barrel one. We'll see. Oh, dude, it does kind of. It hurts more than I thought. Off the end, it never hurts. Off the hands, it the still stings. Stink. Oh, oh that that is as hard as I'm gonna hit the ball. Ninety-eight six. Okay, if you're an absolute dog and you're hitting bombs with anything, this is a great bat. That's hit well. Really? That's bad, boys. Matt! That's, that's as good as you can. 96.7. Dude! What? More? 
decent barrel there? Yeah. Don't hit A the little bolt. bit under it. All right. Second barrel? Yeah. That needs to go. That That's gone. Bro. Yeah, that should totally get out. 100%. You, you think that's that's a ball that should go out? Yeah. Like I've, I've hit balls worse. That got, like last night, I hit balls worse than we're getting out. All right, that will go out. That's like going that go to go out. That's going to go out. Good swing. Yeah. All right, give her one more chance. That's all. That's about as good Bolt, as you can there. Yeah. 92.5. So Vila's aren't even close. Woo. It, it hurts your hands a lot more than I thought it would. Whoa. Whoa. It's got it's got enough for that. Alright, alright. We're good. 90. What? 921. I mean I felt like that was decent, but it just 91? didn't it just didn't come off good, yeah. I feel like the main benefit of this bat should be feel, and it's not doing that. Like a birch bat feels better. Oh, smash! Dude, if that's not upper 90s. Yeah, it's not even going to go out. Definitely and it is a new day, so for reference, going back to the Mitch Hanniger. Mitch Hanniger, I love you. Come hit with us. That's it right there. That's it as well. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is, dude, I'm happy for you. <laughs> oh! Is this better? Oh, my gosh. A little bit. 99.6. Wow, dude. Yeah, man, it's just to me, it feels like this just has a lot more, a lot more room to miss. Yeah. With this bat, I feel like here to here, I'm, I'm good. It's like 45 degrees today, which is a lot better than it was yesterday. But yeah. anybody that's ever swung a bomb bat knows what's coming here. Oh, Ripped if our the hands. Dean Marini's hurting our hands, yeah. bro. We are moving on to our luxury item. The $300, roughly, 280 to 350 or so, the bomb bat. Gold maple 34-inch end load. We have the flared handle, because I think the regular knob they use is pretty bad. I'm just going to call it early. Least forgiveness, worst sweet spot, but highest velo overall. All right. That wasn't too bad. It's hot. I can already tell we're going to get highest velo right here. It's hot. Yeah, it, that's the, it's the loudest. 93. That, that was no legs 93. How am I going to have That was bad. <laughs> that's, that's crazy, though. Uh oh. Uh oh. I really got out in front, though. Oh, that was, oh, was smash. 103. 103. Yeah. Boy. Whoa. There's that sound. Oh boy. Yeah, that came up Damn. That's fun. bat in the world. Oh boy. 95. Yeah, it's I'm not going to lie. That ball's probably not getting out with a lot of wood bats. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. oh. Yeah. Oh. All right. Good enough. That's hot. I mean, dude, that's that, honestly not out of the question. No, that might have been. It, it's the hottest bat here. It's not even close. Yes. That's that's over the fence. That was absolutely killed. Whoa! There he is. That's P. That's P. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. It well. That's nice. Dude, that's a healthy swing. Woo! I like that. Like, you did it twice. Yes! Oh! That was tight. Wow. Dude, that is making a case. You swing the heck out of that thing. That's three of them. <laughs> See if you can even get within like two miles an hour. Oh, that a boy? Like, that's spinning so much. That's gonna leave us. Yeah, it's just better loft. That car better move. Oh, oh see what? Nine, it, eight, it's not as hot, man. That's it that's, pretty well, that's yeah? A, 
That's a complimentary swing. Though. Yeah, three, two. Yeah. Oh, he's close. Hey, try with the perch. Right. Three miles an hour. That is a case. That is making the case. Ooh. That was smart. That looks the coolest. 128. 128. That's, that's smashed. That's our chance. 134. Wow. So it's three, three miles, miles an hour. I will say the inloaded, first time ever swinging the inloaded version, it does make a difference. It's, it's, I would, I would definitely recommend it. It's the only way to go with the bomb bat in my opinion. Yeah. Alright, one time back through all of them. Oh yeah. Kind of knuckled it. Dude. Ooh. 95 Might be the best bang for your buck. Out of every, I mean, it, it's got to be. It's definitely, uh, been, it's definitely been the most surprising bet. All right, Dean Rooney would composite 150 bucks. That was absolutely hammered. If that's not 100 miles an hour, nice. That took the biggest L of the day. I swear, bomb bat. Ow! Dude, that hurt. That's way gone. That hurt really, really bad. That's the story of the bomb bat. Yeah. Mitch Haniger. Victus Birch. Yeah. Absolutely peace. 400 feet. All right. I need one more swing with this yes. before I make my final decision, bro. Oh, yeah. What was that? 95. A little lower velo. But also, like the barrel's a little less forgiving. It's a little heavier, but for $50, $70, that's, that's insane, honestly. Yeah, still One of the best bats I've found for that, especially if it's gonna be durable, dude. All right, fellas, uh, got some decisions to make. We have all our bats right here. We got them in categories. We have the real wood bats, the bomb, the Demarini, the bamboos. We're gonna start with just pure performance. Pretend durability is the same on every bat. Pretend they're all 99 bucks. Drew, we'll start with you. Hard not to like the bomb bat. I mean, three or four mile an hour harder with this than anything else. I mean, it, it can do it. Um, you know, really, the this, this was probably the most impressive bat um, to me the last two days. I mean, we knew what we were going to get with the bomb bat, but this actually impressed me. I mean, I I could I could swing this thing if I needed to, and especially for 50 bucks. I mean, and not gonna lie, JT, prop, props to you for this, but this thing is trash. You didn't like it, bro. All right. <laughs> I mean, performance alone. I mean, my gamer is. I'm gaming it for a reason. Good. Yeah, throw that one out because that one's. Right. Other than that, worst bat. The Demarini. This one right here, I think so. exit velos, prove it right there. I was smoke, I was barreling balls up with this, and it was 94. All you need to know. Yeah. You got a, a big, you got WWBA next week. What are you gaming? It surprised me because I didn't think the bomb bat was gonna feel as good, but the end loaded bomb bat had the most pop. It didn't ring that bad. I'm going with the bomb bat. Wow, out of boy, I like that. <laughs> All right, then for me, fellas, I'll just simplify it between these two bats for bamboo. The 271s, they just ring you up way too bad. They're not very good. Uh, mass equals gas when it comes to bamboo, 100%. You got to get a 243. Uh, definitely get a little bit heavier one. If you're going to do that, maybe be conservative uh, on the size of your bat. But especially, like, if you want a heavier wood bat for training and stuff, like, I don't know of any better option than a bamboo bat. Durable, cheap, and it actually hits and sounds like a wood bat. These are absolutely underrated. People trash on these for no reason. And between these two bats, this is the hottest bat here and it's not close. But as a gamer, I think this performed better. But guys, it $200 for a bat that might break very quickly. Honestly, okay, if I'm if I'm like a 16, 17 year old, I'm buying a bat with my own money, man. I would probably buy a bomb bat end load, if I'm being honest, with the flared handle. Purely for durability and cost efficiency, even though this is expensive, you'll be able to use this for a while, man. Durability aside, price aside, this was the best bat here. Birch all day, I love it. So there you have it folks. Big thank you to Oglethorpe for having us out today. If you guys liked the video, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel, head over to baseballbatbros.com to see our top BB Core rankings along with our merch. We'll see you next time. Peace out.